So welcome guys to Taganga. I've been here for a week now, uh, almost two weeks actually, because I really love this place. It's a very relaxed kind of like fishing village. Before it used to be very touristy, but because of the pandemic that went down drastically and now it's a fishing village again, mainly. That's why you see a lot of fishing boats here and uh, some of these boats actually do take tourists around to other beaches but you don't really have to take a, a boat if you want to go to the beach where we're going today we're going to Playa de Pescadores I don't know if that's the real name Henemata is the real name Henemata well we're going to a beach I'm also with my friend my local friend she's very cool look at that guys this is all of Taganga my hotel is somewhere here you just walk in into the town for like 30 seconds from the beach and then you're in my hotel that's where I've been living for a while now in the weekends I go to Santa Marta because the weekends in Santa Marta are amazing I'll be making a vlog about that in the near future but now I just want to go for a swim look at that So, only after a five minute hike, we have arrived at the beach. Look, someone is cooking fish there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just check it out real quick. They don't really have kitchens here. They just use a fire, like a natural kitchen. Look at that. Feels like a very laid back beach. The other one has a lot of tourists during the weekend actually, today. It's a normal day. What is he ass? What is he ass? Ooh, there's some fish here. Wow. Gracias. But here it's just locals. I think they are locals. And, uh, and us. There is no one else here. Look at that. Lots of uh, materials to do the fishing. Lots of nets. Fishing boat. A very charming place. And you can go swimming here. So all of this is one big net to catch fish. And they're just gonna pull it in later on. You see the rope here. But this part, this tiny little part of the beach is, uh, is for swimming. So you don't swim into the net yourself. But it's great, there's no one. I know. We got like a private beach. That's really nice. The other beach has some people like, oh, hello. What? Oh, a mini dog? It's just Whoa. alone here. I'm gonna give him water. That's adorable. You, you, <laughs> ah, you didn't know him. No. He's called, he's called Henemaka, like the beach. Really? He's like the local. Yeah, he's super sweet. The Henemaka. local beach dog. Henemaka. Henemaka. Ven, ven. 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 Mira. Hello, Maka. Hello, Maka. He's we got, we got, inviting you. I want <laughs> to give him some water. Wait a bit. Wait. He doesn't want any. Look at this, guys. We have basically a private beach. The other beach always has some people on it. But uh, if you want some privacy, you can just hike for like it's not really hiking you just walk for like five minutes and then you're uh, here at the fishing beach and it's just beautiful look at that the green hills oh it's so cold <laughs> <laughs> okay i mean you know once you're swimming it's actually pretty nice refreshing here in taganga i go for a swim every day in the morning normally on the main beach but today this special beach for you guys for the vlog look at that
So these are our local friends. Last time they prepared fish for us. Yeah, somewhere in the jungle on a real fire. And I made the best vlog ever, but sadly I lost all of those shots. So uh, that's why we're here now again to make a video of this beach. They're really cool people. People here in Taganga are just relaxed, they're just very kind. They let us put our stuff in, uh, in their little house, their little shop here. Okay, so we were just relaxing on the beach and then uh, someone started shouting Hala and then uh, everyone got up right there. You can see a lot of people. They're pulling in the net and uh, we're gonna see how many fish they catch. This is so exciting because I actually also made a vlog about this. Uh, a week ago but sadly I lost all of those shots so uh, I was hoping to see this again and here we are I think they do this every day maybe several times a day so uh, let's just hope it's a lot of fish because if it's a lot of fish like last time last time there was like a thousand fish there then uh, it's one big party for everyone and super interesting to watch Se me ha mojado. Se me ha mojado. Se me ha mojado. So the birds are also ready to uh, steal some fish, I guess. They're all waiting. Mía, espérate, da tu afán. 
Sadly, there weren't too many fish uh, this morning. Last time it was literally a thousand. It was like the whole net was full, and uh, the whole the whole beach was like super happy about uh, that day's catch. I think this is one crate, and uh, last time it was like maybe 20 crates. It's just crazy. Anyways, I still got to show you guys how it works on this beach. And you can see this for yourself. You just go to Taganga, which is there. You hike for five minutes, then you're here. And uh, as I said, they do this every day. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Stay safe, stay awesome, and see you in the next vlog.